Quick Steps in Outlook lets you apply multiple actions to a message with one click. Hi, I'm Don Bjork, the Software Pro. In this quick tip, we'll look at how to save time by creating Quick Steps in Outlook. You'll find Quick Steps in the Home tab of the ribbon. Outlook includes several default Quick Steps, including moving to a folder and creating a message for a team. Quick Steps can be a great way to simplify repetitive steps. Unlike rules, which are always on and automatically process incoming mail, you decide when you want to use a quick step. You can also create your own and delete the ones that you don't need. For this quick step, I want to move a message to a folder and then mark it as read. So although I could modify this existing one, instead I'll choose Create New. I want this quick step to take any type of technology newsletters or Microsoft mailings and move them to my tech newsletters folder. So I'll name it for that purpose. Next, choose an action for the quick step. Take some time to review these different actions. It could be anything from moving to a folder, changing the status, flagging with categories, changing a message to a task, responding, many of the key things that we do in Outlook. For this, I'll move to a folder and then choose the folder, which is my tech newsletters. That might be all that we need. I'll add one more action, and this is to mark the message as read. You would continue to add actions as they apply, and so the sequence of actions will happen simply by clicking on the quick step. If this is a quick step that you anticipate you'll be using a lot, you could also assign it an optional shortcut key. And now I'll finish. To try this out, I could simply move to the message. You'll see that this quick step now is displayed in my quick steps group in the home tab and click on it once or my keyboard shortcut control shift one in this case. Regardless of how I applied the quick step, those two messages have moved to my tech newsletters folder. Once you've created some quick steps, you can also manage them. Simply click into this group, and here is Manage Quick Steps. From here, we have the option to move the quick step up or down in the list. You can edit a quick step, duplicate one to add or change some of the actions, or delete quick steps you no longer need. Explore these options to see how you can take advantage of Quick Steps in Outlook. For more tips on being productive with Microsoft Outlook or to sign up for my tips newsletter, visit thesoftwarepro.com slash Outlook. If this training was helpful, please like this video and subscribe to this channel. This is Don Bjork, the Software Pro. Thanks for watching.